the str str function receives two arguments or three depends well it is defined with three parameters but the third one is an option we don't have to pass over uh, an argument for the third parameter well when calling str str with two arguments uh, we actually pass over a string and another string we are looking for within this one in this case we can find uh, this string here the str str function returns the substring that start with the first occurrence of the string we were looking for so in this case even if we have a few more we shall get uh, this substring back from calling this method so we can then see it printed to the screen so let's execute it and see the output if we do pass over a third argument it should be true or false um, if we pass over true we shall get a substring that starts in the beginning of the string the long one we have till the first occurrence of the string we are looking for let's execute this code as you can see we received back from calling this function a string that starts in the beginning of the string we have till the first occurrence of the string we were looking for